Cloaked in the cool darkness of the Scottish night, a figure emerged from the dense woods surrounding Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Her figure was slim and tall, cloaked in an array of dark emerald fabrics that twirled in the breeze as she advanced toward the looming castle. Her name was Lysandra Sable, a witch of terrifying power and insidious ambition. Lysandra Sable was not a regular guest of Hogwarts. In fact, there was little conventional about her at all. She hailed from an old, powerful bloodline that had been almost buried in history, a bloodline feared and respected for centuries, a bloodline so old and ancient it could trace its roots back to the time of the Founders itself. With a face etched from cold stone, Lysandra cut an intimidating figure. Her eyes, a deep, mesmerizing midnight blue, possessed an undeniable allure that was both terrifying and fascinating. Her raven-black hair cascaded down in tight, intricate braids, shimmering under the scant moonlight. She wore her family's symbol, a silver snake entwined around a dark sapphire, proudly around her neck, glistening ominously. Her usually rigid stance softened momentarily as the castle appeared in sight. Her voice was a quiet command, compelling obedience with a soft, melodious lilt that held the chilling precision and poise of a predator. She wielded her wand with the ease and languid grace of a seasoned fighter, a master duelist who had faced countless adversaries and emerged victorious. A renowned potioneering expert in the magical world, Lysandra was employed by the Ministry, consulting on the most complex cases of potion misuse. However, behind her perfected exterior and the respect she commanded in the wizarding community lay a treacherous ambition. She wasn't content with her considerable achievements, she yearned for more. She harbored a desire for the dark arts and the deepest secrets hidden within the castle walls. Lysandra was no stranger to the corridors of Hogwarts. She was a frequent guest at the professor's table, despite the unease and suspicious glances thrown her way by the students. She strived to ingratiate herself with the headmaster, flaunting her knowledge and expertise at every opportunity and weaving her deceitful charade with ease. Lysandra Sable was no mere witch. She was a carefully disguised treat, an insidious villainess harboring extravagant ambitions, one who, amidst the jumbled normality of Hogwarts, was plotting a dangerous path to seize a power at whatever cost. As she approached the castle, the looming silhouette silhouetted against the night ski, she wore a chilling grin, for in their midst was a villain so souple she was already woven into the fabric of the Hogwarts as she plotted its shattering downfall.